Hi guys, my name is Andrea. Um, I just wanted to do a video of me doing my hair. Um, it would be kind of like a, um, like a loose curl kind of look. Um, so if you're interested, just keep watching and I'll show you how I do my hair. Um, now, my hair is um, like naturally wavy curly when it like air dries. Um, I also am a licensed cosmetologist. I went to beauty school and um, uh, I don't work in a salon anymore, but oh, I have a lot of hair. Um, I'll show you what I like to do to my hair. I mean, it's something, this is a look. Um, I don't do my hair like this all the time just because I really honestly don't put a lot of heat into my hair. Um, but, Jesus, ew, and then you can see where I've colored my hair. Gross. Um, again, this will be just kind of like a, a loose curl. My hair is crazy right now. Um, so first thing, comb out your hair or brush your hair out. Um, I will be using, uh, this curling iron. This is like super old. Um, the Hot Tools. Is this Hot Tools? Um, I think it is. Honestly, I can't remember. Or it's like gold something. Um, I think this is like an inch and a half. Uh, this is what I like to use, uh, for my curls. And then for, um, flattening out more areas like up here, I have my Paul Mitchell flat iron. Um, I'm gonna go grab a clip. BRB. Alright, so I have my clip. So, me personally, I just like to have a clip. A comb or a brush and my tools so I'll just section a, um, some hair at the bottom back here probably right at the occipital bone or right underneath the occipital bone um, split it into two and just comb it out nice and smoothly now um, I don't put any product in my hair I know some of you are like, oh my god, but I don't. So what I like to do with a curling iron is always curl away from your face. Um, well, at least that's what I like to do. So I'll put the curling iron here and then slowly just wrap it around the curling iron and hold it there for a little bit. And maybe about like 10 seconds or so, and then um, release, and then move to the other side. But again, I like to curl away from the face, um, so the hair is like not always like, I hate that the sometimes when the curls are like in your face kind of thing, if that makes sense. Then I just let it out, and there's your curl. Now for the other side, same thing. I like to brush it out or comb it out. And of course, don't burn your fingers. Um, if you have a wand, it will work with a wand as well. Um, a lot of people do their curls with flat irons as well. That's something you can do as well. To me, when I do my flat irons with my, um, or I'm sorry, when I do my curls with my flat iron, I just feel like they're, they're too tight for me for the look that I'm going for um, sometimes. So again, there it is. Um, and I don't brush it out. I just kind of just leave them alone and move on. Um, so then I go from the top of the ear all the way back. And I proceed. Now, the only reason why I don't put any product in my hair, I just, I don't know. I, I think that's just a personal opinion. Um, at the end of each week, um, I like to 
um, like on a Friday, since I don't work on Saturdays, Sundays, um, on Fridays I like to just come home and just like, not lather, but I mean distribute coconut oil all over my hair and on my scalp and massage it in and just like French braid my hair or something like that. And then I'll just go to sleep and then sun or Saturday morning, I'll just wash it out or whatever. And that's been amazing. I love putting coconut oil in my hair. It's like the best thing. I think, I honestly think it's the best product you could ever put in your hair. Um, I've used all sorts of things. Um, I've used um, AG products that were like leave-in conditioners, hair masks and stuff like that. And they work really good, but at the same time, it's just kind of like, it's just really coating your hair, if you know? So I just felt that the coconut oil just like did the best for me. Um, but yeah, I used to be like platinum blonde and uh, my hair is so damaged and so after I colored it dark again, I kind of just um, started doing coconut oil on my hair and my hair felt so nice and so soft and I didn't feel like it was fried when it was and stuff like that. So I don't know, to me it's just like a holy grail. But um, what I'm gonna go, go ahead and do right now, you can pretty much see what I'm doing, I'm curling away from the base and just sectioning the hair. So I'm just gonna speed this up and then we can proceed from there. Um, and then we'll see how it goes. All right, so since we have issues with the curling iron, I'm going to finish the rest of it with uh, my flat iron. Um, like I said, it does give me a different curl. It's not as loose as I want it, um, no matter how hard I try. So let me go ahead and show you how I do it and then proceed from there. And still with the um, flat iron, we're gonna be um, curling away from the face still, so what I like to do is clamp the cur the flat iron and smooth out this hair that's up, up here because I don't want the curl to start up here. Um, so I will clamp the flat iron and then smooth down and then curl away from the face. So that's what I'll be doing now. So um, right now I have my curling iron set to a 410. Um, that's the highest that it'll go. So again, Smooth down, and since I'll be curling away from the face, position the flat iron the way you need it to, and twist, and then pull away from the face, and you have your curl. Now, honestly, flat iron curls can be hard for some people, so of course, practice makes perfect, so go ahead and just practice and you'll get it eventually <laughs> um so flat iron the top here twist i just do one twist myself and then i pull away from the face and i get my curl that way so i'm just gonna fix some of these curls so it just looks all uniform so i'll be back once i'm done with this side and everything is good to go so I'll speed through this.
Um, now because I am parting my hair to the side, um, when I am curling my hair, I like to, obviously the hair on this side, um, it might be shorter on this side, especially if you have layers. So I would keep that in mind when curling your hair as well, because you don't want to um, do a curl on this side the same way you did it on this side, and then now you have a curl like up here. So just keep that in mind, try to even it out. Um, start lower on this side if you have a lot of um, uh, layers to prevent it from being like off or anything like that and it'll be it'll look more symmetrical as well All right, guys, so this is the final look. Um, just soft curls, I hope you like. Um, I'll list everything that I used down below. Um, if you have any questions or anything, just let me know. Um, but other than that, this is it, and hope you guys like. Please subscribe and um, give this video a thumbs up.